hello again guys it's Jim Rutter with the PA Woodsman channel we're out here today trying out the uh, snowshoes I bought back in October I'll tell you already uh, there's a few things I'm gonna need to work on when I get home straps are just not right I have the one just tied right at the moment because I couldn't get any enough holes in it so that you're gonna have to take them nice and slow you can't go fast with these on but you'll end up catching the other shoe and tripping over it so <coughs> excuse me so we're just out here today it's the uh, last day of flintlock season just saw 12 other hunters so i'm going to keep this real brief right here we're going to get further back in and stop and have some coffee so i'll check back in after a while Well, we stopped, we're gonna take a little break back here at an overlook. Give you a little bit of an idea of what we're looking at. Nice ridge out there. River's just down here below, see if I can pan in on it. I'm trying this, I got a lot of sun in my back, so it's hard to see the viewfinder. But there's the river. This is just above uh, my one video I went geocaching in Buttermilk Falls, which is down below me here. I'm right on top of this real tall ridge line, so. But uh, spin this around here. Got my shoes sitting over there. Back, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, set up my alcohol stove, have a cup of coffee, then venture back. Uh, came across this gas well road so I got to actually uh, walk on uh, uh, not patched snow. Shoes did pretty good. Uh, I still got to get used to them. On the way back though, I am going to just uh, choose not to wear them because uh, there's enough uh, tracks in the road that I can walk uh, without needing them because they're just actually slowing me down right now. So, But it's just something I'm gonna have to practice with. So we're just gonna go ahead and stop the video and uh, make some coffee and I'll probably get back to you after a bit. Just to make enough a cup of coffee. So. Oh, it's twenty to twelve. Let's see how long it takes to come to a boil. Well, it looks like we're at a boil in about. Uh, seven minutes so I know we did that video the other day where I uh, tried every stove out I wouldn't say this is a rapid boil but it's a boil 
uh, good enough for toffee. But uh, also, like I said uh, the other day when we did our experiment, I had the fuel sitting out and the water outside all night. This stuff has been in my house all through the night, and then uh, the fuel has been in my uh, uh, backpack. So it's had time to uh, stay warm. So, we're going to stand back here, just relax, uh, and head back here after a while. So. Well, I just heard a shot. I don't know if somebody took aim at a deer, or they might have just been clearing their flintlock. So, hey, uh, while we're standing here, I ain't going to give a big review today. I don't have the time, but uh, managed to pick up my uh, another shot there. Uh, Wetterling's hunting axe. I had the Grand Forks first came, and I really wasn't too impressed with it, so they switched it out for a Wetterling's. He picked out one for me. Did some sharpening last night on my uh, Japanese water and stone, so it's pretty sharp now. I could have time to mess with it today. Uh, next weekend, I should have more time to do a better review on it as well as a Enzo Trapper 01 steel I have on order should be in this week too so well I'm gonna go ahead and put this up there stay clear while people are doing their firing so get back to you later alrighty we're on our way out almost didn't get out I don't have the perfect uh, tires on this thing for winter I got dull season radials well, they're getting snow tires next year. I got out, but we almost didn't. So, well, made a long story short, guys. Snowshoes did pretty good. I floated really well with them. Uh, I came out without them on, though. Make it a little easier getting out due to the fact that there was a lot of uh, beaten down paths with the uh, vehicles back and forth in here, and plus my original track. So I just walked back, saw where I did float really well. Uh, and like I said, I'll do another video here next weekend, a little bit more in depth with the uh, Grand Force uh, Brooks Axe, the Gretchen, that was the one I had, my Wetlings Axe, so, uh, and the Enzo Trapper and whatever else I can figure out. So, well guys, I'm going to get myself back to the house and uh, get warmed up. So, it's a beautiful day out here, the sun's shining, first time in probably uh, two weeks, so we're going to enjoy the ride home. Talk to you later.